The men's basketball team exceeded expectations in their first season of full Division I eligibility. The Spartans, picked ninth in the preseason Atlantic Sun Poles, posted a 21-13 overall record and finished tied for second in the Ace Sun with a 13-5 league mark. The Spartans advanced to the second round of the College Insider Tournament after a dominant 73-58 victory over perennial power Kent State. The team posted the top turnaround in Division I basketball with a 16-win improvement, and the Spartans took home three of the four Ace Sun yearly awards. Head coach Eddie Payne, who was also awarded the Hugh Durham Award as the nation's top mid-major coach, was tagged the league's coach of the year. Tory Craig was named the conference's player of the year, while Ty Green was selected as the freshman of the year. The Spartans finished the season 12-1 at home with victories over A-Sun champion Belmont, as well as Kent State in the first round of the CIT. To have the success we had and then get invited and play in a postseason tournament and, not, and then to host it and win a game it really is a terrific experience for our players to experience that aspect of college basketball. Uh, obviously our goals will change and, uh, and we'll hopefully to, uh, try to improve, but just having gone through the experience of preparing for a team that you don't know much about there, you know, after going through a whole conference season, really basically constitutes a dry run for what we hope will happen for us in the future. Um, we know that will be hard to achieve, but I think the whole process that we went through at the end of the last season can do nothing but help us, help prepare us for the upcoming uh, season and hopefully the upcoming postseason. We're also very real grateful to uh, Chalmers Rogers and Carter Cook who've been with us for four years and have been here during the very difficult times and, and, and helped establish a uh, attitude and, a, and that, that, that certainly uh, exists in our program now and we've, we thank those two young men and uh, greatly appreciate their efforts and they will always be a part of this program here.